hi guys join me in the kitchen let me show you how i prepare this fish pile guys you need just few ingredients in a bowl i have three cups of flour three tablespoons of sugar a pinch of salt and a pinch of nutmeg i make sure i put all the dry ingredients together and combine them add in your one tablespoon of baking powder combine it as i'm doing now I'm going to take you through this step by step and I add in 100 grams of butter. Combine it very, very well. Add in four eggs, guys. Four eggs. After you add in your four eggs, now it's time to add two tablespoons of milk. Mix your dough now. I'm going to mix it for some minutes. Then I'm going to transfer it into my working space and then knead it the way I want it. So once I achieve what I want, I'm going to cover it with a clean fin and set it aside. Then I'm going to prepare the filling for the fish pie. Guys, you can prepare your filling in different, different ways. But you see this one that I'm going to show you? Trust me, it's very, very delicious, sumptuous. With all the ingredients and the spicy that I use, trust me, you are going to love it. I want you to give it a try and thank me later. So now set it aside. Let's prepare the filling. For the filling, I have my diced onions, my scotch bonnet pepper, maggi cube, my mackerel fish, and the spicy that I use is white pepper, black pepper, garlic, a little bit of ginger, tomato paste, salt, thyme, rosemary. Let's prepare the filling. With all the spices, trust me, it's going to be very delicious. First of all, I'm going to add in my onions. Guys, if you are preparing your filling for whatever meat pile, fish pile, whatever it is, make sure the oil is not too much. Less oil. The oil has to be just a little bit. Okay? And then I add in my tomato paste. I'm going to stir it, let it fry. For some few minutes then i'll come in with the other spices guys this is very easy to prepare and also very very fast the first thing you need to do just prepare your dough set it aside and go for the filling here you can see me adding my garlic black pepper a pinch of salt going with my thyme adding a little bit of thyme depend on the quantity of your your sauce and adding a rosemary maggi cube i use gino maggi cube just one cube now just a pinch because the sauce is not too much i use just a little bit so i stir it very very well now it's time for me to add in my mackerel fish you can use any other fish of your choice depending on the one that has less bone because when you are preparing your fish oil, you don't need bone you need boneless fish guys so i go i went for mackerel so it's perfect for me so as you can see the filling you will not see any oil in it as you can see it's very very dry that's how it should be so it's done it's time for me to dish it out i'm going to put it in this plate allow it to cool then i'm going to prepare my roll as you can see me doing now just set it aside let it sit for some minutes so that it will get cool now it's time for us to roll our guys let me say something fish pile you can roll it any how you want it you can roll this i just use this method because this is just for the sake of this video you can roll it in another way you can make any form or any style that you want but i just decided to do it this way just like you are seeing so it is done i'm going to put it in the oven now so you can fry yours but i choose this way because it's very good for me for my health so this is me try to assemble it showing you the result it's so delicious very very moist you can do your meat pile also the same way you can still use the same recipe for meat pile especially for the dough you can use the same recipe thank you all so much for watching see you all in my next video please don't forget to like and share bye bye